Hello everyone, it's Mel here. Welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, I have got a designer haul video for you. Now, some of the items I'll be sharing with you, I've actually bought probably in the last six weeks. So I just haven't had the chance to reveal them yet. I actually haven't even revealed them on Instagram. So it's going to be something yeah, new for everybody. But the reason I decided to do like, I guess a collective designer haul is because I had a friend that just came back from Europe and I just saw her yesterday and I asked her to find a couple of goodies if she could find them for me at Hermes and she did. So I will reveal all to you now. So it is going to be an unboxing. So let's go close and personal and let's unbox them together because they're smaller items. I thought it would be better to go up close and you know, good things come in small packages too. So let's start off with Chanel. So I picked up a couple of things a couple of weeks ago now and we'll start off with this one. I got this little cutie and this is the Choupette brooch and look how cute it is. So it's got all crystals and the eyes are in the CC sort of shape and this is the size small. Now there was a whole range. There was the brooch, it came in cuffs, earrings, I think a necklace but I chose to go with the little brooch. I think it will look so cute just sort of pinned onto a jumper or even a shirt in the middle of the shirt. So I'm excited to style this little cutie. And for those that weren't aware, Choupette is Carl Lagerfeld's beloved cat. The second item I got is in this little box. And for those of you that know me, this will come as no surprise because you know I am obsessed with, of course it has to be Chanel earrings. Like that Chanel earrings. So this is what I chose. Look how pretty they are. They are in black and silver. And I saw this in the brooch as well, but I actually really liked how this looked on my ears. And I will show you a pic of it, what it looks like worn. But yeah, I really like the combination of the baguettes and just the little black sort of diamante sort of jewels in there. And yeah, so those are my new earrings. So let's move on to Louis Vuitton. Now these pieces I picked up probably about in the middle of September, so probably five or six weeks ago. And I do remember asking you guys on Instagram your advice. So it is the new transatlantic range. And the first item, oh, by the way, guys, please excuse my nails. They're, I need to get them refilled, so don't mind my nails. But anyway, back to this. I got, the first piece I got from the transatlantic range was this little charm. And I really liked the monogram and it's just so pretty with the pink and the cruise ship. I love the little details on this. See that little, I'm not sure if the camera will pick it up, but even the chest is all LV on it. And it is just so pretty. And in terms of the charm, it only came in the monogram and the Damia Ebene. So I went with the monogram because the limited illustration from last year I already have an Ebene. So that's why I got this in mono. And the second item I got, I actually got this one first and they, um, they still had the old box, but that's okay. So... I bought this guy and you probably can hear already and it is the mini pochette in the transatlantic range and also in the monogram. Now I was really having a hard time deciding if I wanted the monogram or the azure and I ended up going with this only because I use my mini pochettes quite a lot. So I think the monogram will, will probably wear a little bit better than Azure. I may be wrong, but lighter material, probably a little bit more prone to color transfer. So I plan on using this. I use my plain Demia Abin one like heaps. So I just really, really like this year's illustration. Hence why I bought two things. Normally I probably would only pick one item, but yeah, I just really love the pink tab. 
just just love it all. I think it's such a pretty illustration. And for those of you that are after this, like I know it got released in September. I'm hoping that they'll release a bit more. I know they're quite hard to get, but just speak to your sales associate about it. So that is my second LV item. And the final things I have to unbox is from Hermes. And as I said before, my friend just came back from Europe and I gave her a list of things and she found a couple. So I was like, yay. So let's have a look at the little one first and let's open it together. So there it is. Open it up. So I got the Click H bracelet. So this is in size PM and the color is called Gris Orage and it's sort of like a bluey gray color and I've got one of these. I've got one in white and gold so I was looking for something in silver and as you guys know blue is my favorite color and I was quite open to it and when she showed me a picture of this I was like yeah I really like it. Sort of like a bluey gray and so that is what I got. I think these will probably be very addictive and I can understand why people are so addicted to them and they've got multiples. But yes, this is my second Click H bracelet. So I really like her. Okay, so in the bigger bag, let's have a look. And the box is a little bit bigger. And I got Ta da! Isn't she cute? This is the mini Bjorn wallet and it is in color rose lipstick and it is in the goat skin. So not the Epsom leather, the goat skin. So when she showed me a picture of it and we were like talking when she was overseas, I always wanted something pink and this is such a pretty pink and I'm actually looking for like a smaller wallet. I've been using my Chanel card holder to death. So these are really hard to find in Melbourne. They're always out of stock. So I'm really glad that she found this. I'll just show you. So this is how you open it up. So this is the tab. So you just pull it open like that. And that is what the inside looks like. So as you can see, you can put cards in there. It's got space for cards. You can put some cash in there as well. So this is exactly what I wanted. It's gonna act as my little mini wallet. And I just love the little closure detail. I love the color. And it's just so cute and compact. So I hope you enjoyed those little unboxing guys. Let me know which one is your favorite in the comments box below. So everything that I've unboxed, I will also leave the prices and the description in the drop down box. So have a look if you're interested. And what do I have planned next? I've got some comparisons for you. If you have any suggestions on what bags you would like to see compared or any other suggestions, I'm happy to hear them. I'm, I always read all your comments and thank you so much for all those lovely comments actually that you left on my Chanel collection video. I had a lot of fun filming it and I'm so glad that you guys enjoyed it. I have taken note that you want to see a Gucci one so that will be in the works as well. Thank you so much for watching. Please give me a thumbs up if you like this video and hello for everyone new. Please subscribe if you like what you see. I upload videos about once a week. So have a lovely day or night and I will see you in my next video. Bye.